Good day everyone. Let's try to answer some math problem posted on Facebook. So let's start. Here's the question. Determine the perimeter of the figure. Now, if you want to try this problem, just pause this video and if you're ready, here's the solution. For this kind of problem, you can answer this kind of question within 5 seconds, if you know the trick. Now, if you don't know the trick, watch the video until the end. Our goal in this problem is to find the perimeter. And the first thing to do is what is a perimeter? So, perimeter of a figure is the distance around the edge of a shape. Therefore, the perimeter is just the sum of all sides of this polygon. At first glance, this question is impossible because we don't have enough given. Like the given is this side, this side, and this side. We have 4 meters, 5 meters, and 6 meters. And we don't have any measurements to the other side. But this question is answerable. First thing to do is to make a perpendicular line like this. So we create a rectangle on the bottom part. Now since the top part is 5 meters, it follows that the bottom part is also 5 meters. Next, we will use some variables to name the other side of this figure. So we have this one, A, and this side is B, this side is C, this is D, and this is E. At this point, we can now find the perimeter of this figure. So the perimeter of this figure must be the sum of all sides. So we have 4 plus A plus D plus B plus 5 plus C plus 5 plus E and plus 6. So we have the perimeter 4 plus A plus D plus B plus 5 plus C plus 5 plus E plus 6. Now rearrange and we get the perimeter of this figure must be equal to 20 plus A plus B plus C plus D plus E. Now at this point, draw some horizontal line like this. Now we can see the purpose of this horizontal line later on. Now notice that this side length is A and this side length is also A. This length is B and in the opposite side, we also have the length of B. This side measures C and the opposite side is also C. Therefore, the side A plus B plus C is simply equal to 6 meters. Therefore, this A plus B plus C is simply 6. Next, how about the value of D plus E? So at this point, we draw vertical line like this. Now notice this side measures D and on the opposite side is also D. And this side is E and the opposite side is also measures E. It follows that E plus D is equal to 4 meters. Therefore, this D plus E is simply 4 meters. It follows that the perimeter of this figure must be 20 plus the value of A plus B plus C is 6 meters plus the value of D plus E is 4 meters. Therefore, the perimeter is simply 20 plus 6 plus 4 or simply 30 meters. And we're done.